Welcome to Action 10 News at 5. I'm Aron Hammy. A string of Corpus Christi stores is seeing an unusual surge in shoplifting. The owner of these stores says it isn't just one group of people, but people of all ages. This is just an annoying incidents that may happen. I don't know, God knows how many unknown incidents has happened. Peter Patel owns five local grocery stores such as Norton Food Market, QC Meat Market, and Hi Ho Convenience Store. Each has been plagued by people stealing anything from meat to lottery tickets. Mostly they're getting expensive items. Uh, detergent, for example. I have one knife display and it's happened twice. Same persons picking up front of the other employees and just walking out. Patel says it's been hard for employees to stop them. Sometimes these people will target a time when a woman might be working and intimidate her and threaten to overpower her. If a man is working, weapons would be drawn. I was there and I saw those one guys walking out the stuff. I stopped him and he pulled out the knife, you know, and I says, okay, it's, it's not worth to risk myself, you know, so I let him go. But those things is happening often. Patel thinks it's happening for a number of reasons, from young people doing it for the thrill or older people stealing to then sell things to get cash. The unemployment, um, same sometimes personal behavior, you know, that person has been doing this for so long, you know, and they are knowing that it's a soft target over here and easy to get it. Patel is looking for a solution to stop with all the thefts. It's causing backlash to the customers who face increased prices to make up for losses. Patel says he often gets the question why he doesn't have a security system. It's just out of his price range, but if he did have one, again, prices would have to go up. Reporting in Corpus Christi around Hammy, Action 10 News.